what it do y'all welcome back to my channel family today's video is a nacho mexican mukbang and it's to talk about our well my birthday my baby threw me uh basically like a surprise party it was supposed to be like a surprise party at first but then mm -hmm. i found out about it and it just yeah. turned into a birthday party or a birthday yeah. dinner yeah my baby hooked us up we got some uh nacho she cooked yes with and the, these are sweet chili right right with the sweet, sweet chili, chili doritos. doritos they be banging she be doing her thing with it look at his nachos compared to hers look at mine so on mine's i got queso lettuce tomatoes and sour cream with the meat and the chips and he have the meat the cheese and some lettuce he don't eat a lot of stuff right. that i eat so mm -hmm. yeah that's why my plate look much y'all already know that though look much colorful and we got the good punch oh we got some punch right mm -hmm. here mm -hmm. When I tell y'all this punch is good. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. But yeah, we just wanted to chime in and do a mukbang about a uh, mukbang, mukbang. Yeah. About a uh, mukbang. About you know her her weekend. She it was pretty. Well, cool. it wasn't even the weekend actually. My birthday fell on a Thursday, mm -hmm. and it was September 10th, like literally like a few days ago. But I'm kind of still recouping y'all because it was a long day and night. <laughs> So, a lot was going on um, from getting her cakes together, the food together. Mm -hmm. It was all kind of strange because I was trying to do it without her knowing. But like she said, she found out about it. This sneaky son of a... And I had pretty much had everything together. So, I was just letting her know, like, I got this. You know, like, I, I got you. You know what I'm saying? I started asking questions like, what about this? What about that? What about this? And then I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna let him do his thing because it was gonna be a surprise and mm -hmm. I wasn't gonna know nothing anyway. So. And for the most part, she did too. She just I sat back. You know what I'm saying? I was the one stressing the most, you know? <laughs> and I was, she kept saying, like, I'm stressing over stuff I really ain't even need to be stressing about. Like, but I'm just really like that. I'm kind of anal like that. When I want something done and done right, I'd be. So how was that making you feel, like knowing you had like a few things up up your sleeve and you couldn't tell me? <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because we talk about everything, and I wanted to discuss stuff with her, even though she knew about it. I still wanted to keep some stuff a secret because <laughs> I still wanted to surprise her with some stuff. So how did period like I wonder like. How did that make you feel? Cause I never threw no surprise party for nobody before. Or no, you know, like how was that? Like I was really excited about it. You know what I'm saying? Like, cause it was some family members that was coming of hers that I never met, you know, and I couldn't wait to meet them, stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And it was really just something for, it was, if y'all go back and look at the Valentine's Day thing, that I threw a little surprise for her that day. Mm -hmm. It was one thing that we we both kind of talked about for that surprise Valentine's Day thing is she wished some of her family would have been in it. And it was kind of like last minute. I, I thought I did a good job with it and she said I did, but it was a learning tool for me. So this time around, it was no like friends, none of my friends, none of really my family invited. It was really just to celebrate her family to celebrate her mm -hmm. and I to meet that. me too at the same time mm -hmm. so it was it really was it turned out perfect you know i had two of my cousins one of my cousins made the uh, cakes and one of my cousins did it the was cooking gone. <laughs> and everybody loved it it was so much love in the air so cool you know but we was exhausted though afterwards yeah. i was really exhausted because i wasn't really sleeping so oh wanted, my goodness. I wanted it to be, like I said, perfect. But I'm going to tell you the craziest thing that happened. Um, we had to get a new roof put on the house. And it was scheduled for that the Tuesday. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and it rained that Tuesday. So they, they pretty much just told me, like, we're going to reschedule your date because we can't do it while it's raining. Mm -hmm. We get, you know, banging at the door, doorbell going off. On, my birthday. on her birthday <laughs> and then keep in mind they told me it was gonna be a 12-hour job mm -hmm. and it's the roof people right 
We like, what? As soon as I opened the door, they just got right to it. So it was 12 men. They got up it. They banged it out in like five, six hours. Mm -hmm. I and thought they were still going to be here like when people got to showing up and stuff because my party started at yeah. 6 o'clock. And they got here like at 7.30 and we thought it was going to take like 12 hours. So I was like, oh, that's going to be a bit much mm -hmm. going on. So all this is going on at the same time as my birthday dinner today. But they came. So that added more stress. Because <laughs> we both, without even saying it to each other, we was thinking like, what? I know I was. Uh, I'm like, that's going to be a lot of... We was like, what the... <laughs> And then when I did try to get a little sleep, it was kind of impossible because some people are thinking about running to stores and and then they was banging on everything. But after I think about it, maybe they said they was gonna have twelve people. I mean, then we're gonna take twelve hours. But whatever it is, they did their thing. Shout out to them. I ain't gonna say no names. So what? Um. Um. Hold on. Oh God. I then I wanted her, you know, to enjoy her day. And she knows me, so she saw how I was running around with chicken with my head cut off, and she like, look, just do it all. Whatever you're doing, make sure you do it when you leave this time, and so you won't keep having to keep going in and out, in and out. But I was just still trying to set up stuff, and it was so funny because everything I was setting up had a time frame to pick it up, pick it up at this time, pick it up at that time, pick. And I'm like, dang, doing all this picking up, when am I going to be able to get, <laughs> get in the shower and get myself together for this party? Mm -hmm. So what made you, like, how you come up with my second cake? Because I knew about one cake, y'all. I knew that I was going to have, like, a tear cake and it was going to be yellow. I knew about, like, certain stuff for that cake, but he had a whole nother cake with my YouTube, like, banner and a picture of me on there, my subscriber count and stuff. What made you think of that? Well, I was so shocked. Some of it is pretty easy. When you think of like a cake, you think of that person. When you think of a like But I already love. had a cake. That cake. <laughs> like what made you want to get another cake? Because it was a special <laughs> cake just for, <laughs> like for you to, you to see that this is really about you. You know what I'm saying? Like. That I three. mean, my white cake had gold on it. It yeah. had number 32 at the top. Mm -hmm. I had the birthday. It matched me too, y'all. I had on white and gold that day. My cake was white and gold. Mm -hmm. So I, I just knew in my head, like, oh, I'm going to walk downstairs. My cake going to be so pretty. I went downstairs. It was two cakes on the table. I was like, it blew me away. I wish I would have had, like, a camera face on me and the cake at the same time. I'm yeah. like, what? The, what? Yeah. Well, you deserve two cakes. <laughs> oh. Yeah, you know, you know, when I do stuff, I, I try to do it big too, you know, but that kind of makes it hard to top <laughs> when yeah. you be all extra like that. I, well, you know, I'm really from the heart with my stuff, you know what I'm saying? Like, I mm -hmm. think about the person and I think about what I know would just blow your mind you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? or that i would really yeah. like and really be like oh okay he was then, thinking about me mm -hmm. and then with her her birthday means a lot to her meaning her birth date so mm -hmm. if her birthday day. falls on a tuesday <laughs> she wants to celebrate on the tuesday <laughs> Whereas me, I might be like, man, my birthday fall on Wednesday. I get get the, get it in this weekend. Mm -hmm. She not like that. Mm -mm. That's not my birthday. So <laughs> that right there lets you know how much it means to her. You know what I'm my saying? My birthday was on Thursday. I don't know if I told y'all that. I might have said it. Yeah, you did. It was on Thursday. Yeah. <laughs> so I know already it means that much to her. So I said, you know what? We gonna make a big deal out of this thing because <laughs> it's, it's a big deal to her. Mm -hmm. So how do you think everything went though? How do you how do you feel about everything, you know? I loved everything from like even like my brother from that morning when he called, he was coming from Maryland. I was mm -hmm. at the nail shop and that just really made me be like, okay, mm -hmm. I'm about to have a party party and all these was invites that went out with him at first with it was about to be a surprise. 
So then I found out, but I knew he was coming, but it was like, I didn't know he was coming. You know what I'm saying? So when he called me at the shop, it was like, okay, I'm really about to have a party. And then I don't know, like after I got dressed and I came downstairs, because before I went up, they was about to set the food up. So when I actually came downstairs and the cakes was on the table, I was just like, oh my God, my baby loved me. <laughs> I was just like, oh my God, he loved me. I got two cakes. And then seeing everybody just flow through, uh, the family came through, and my baby was like a really, really, really great host. Like he did his thing. He even stopped and fed the dog in between. Right. <laughs> so I was like, you know what? I forgot to feed my dog. Mm -hmm. I was, you know, sipping on something, something. <laughs> and I forget. So I'm like, he even stopped and fed the dog. He was making sure everybody was happy and mm -hmm. showing them my little beauty room and stuff. Mm -hmm. So I was like, this turned out so awesome. All the food was good, was laid out. He got everything set up before he went and got in the shower and mm -hmm. stuff. I was just like, I didn't have to do nothing, nothing. but get dressed. Yeah. And, do my hair and stuff that's all you know, i had to do um, the thing about <laughs> your brother too mm -hmm. it was exciting because when i sent out the uh e-bikes before she found out he was the only one we couldn't get in touch with my brother that stayed out of town yeah in maryland <laughs> mm -hmm. so it was cool and then when he came i still missed him right y'all <laughs> right y'all you know so just you know moving past the party we did get to get together with him for breakfast. And yeah, we did get to, that was yesterday, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yesterday we went to breakfast for him. So that's in another video. So you gotta go watch that video mm -hmm. also. <laughs> but y'all, we danced, we ate good, we you no know, cake and ice cream. It was oh, so mama. much love. Like my mama bought some good ice cream, mm -hmm. <laughs> some good ice cream to go with the good cake. It was yeah. just like it was just so much love. Like she opened her gifts. It oh was, yes, it I opened was, my gifts. Everybody gifts in front of everybody. Yeah. His gifts. Oh, y'all gotta watch the video, mm -hmm. like to see. I ain't gonna name everything I got. Y'all just gotta go watch my birthday party video. Mm -hmm. It was awesome. But even like when we sing a happy birthday, just to see the joy on her face, like she was like. Those people say on cloud nine. She was just I so was, happy. I was like not even there, but there. Like that's mm -hmm. how I was feeling. Like <laughs> yeah, and like I said, it was great for me because my baby was happy. I got to meet some of her family who I hadn't met yet. That made it much more awesome. At the same time, having a birthday party and you meeting my family mm -hmm. that I, that I would want you to meet too. Uh, mm -hmm. That made it that much more special. Yeah, and they love. I mean. They loved like my cousin's cooking. They loved mm -hmm. my cousin's cake, you know. It was So you know that really made them like you know, even if they wasn't gonna like you, they like you. <laughs> even afterwards the love that they were showing me, like a yeah. few of them called her like, Man, yeah. we really like him. Like yeah. we went yesterday to her stylist uh party. Mm -hmm. Like I said, we had a long weekend, y'all. Now I gotta go watch the book. And um <laughs> he was even like still complimenting mm -hmm. her party and he was like one of the things he really liked about it was it showed me like how much i really care about her like it showed like it was all genuine mm -hmm. it wasn't like nothing like oh i'm gonna do this and do that for show sure. he's like mm -hmm. it was all genuine nah, that's just how he is mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. that was so awesome though that was like a memorable birthday that I will never forget, like ever. I will never forget that number. That's what I was real. going for too. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm like, he didn't threw like a party for me. And it was awesome on top of awesome. <laughs> y'all, y'all should have saw this one part. They were all posing like for a picture. And Carly was posing <laughs> right with it. My dog was in picture box. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then when we was dancing, Charlie was uh, like, you know, maneuvering through everybody on the dance floor. It was just so funny. Yes, it was. That party was, as I was happy and everybody else was happy too. Mm -hmm. So it was a success like all the way around. And I was just excited for like somebody to throw me a surprise party or a party period. And then come out successful and give me the gifts that he gave me in front of my family and stuff. Mm -hmm. And I read like 
the stuff out loud. Card, too. And even your like necklace that he gave me, mm -hmm. I read it out loud. And it just was like it, I can't even like explain the feeling I was in. It was just like it was awesome. I can't even really like describe. It's like when I first opened the necklace gift that he gave me, I was like, <gasps> mm -hmm. <laughs> and then when I read it, I was like, mm -hmm. dang. She thought I was playing with her. I was starving. I made me more than you though. <laughs> I did. I'm not playing. She just can't take a compliment that Baby. I smashed her food. Okay, no, I am taking that compliment. Because I never finished my food and look. I am taking that compliment, but I ain't gonna lie, I did. <laughs> I did give me more, I was starving. Yeah, that was good though, that, my was mother, though that was real good. The necklace was very important. That was mm -hmm. like a big thing for me. It was uh, very sentimental, you know, because I meant every word of it. Y'all gotta go watch the want gift. The want gift that he gave me. No, the need gift that he made, not the one. Mm. The need one. Go watch the video. <laughs> man. <laughs> this is everything you need. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that was so funny, man. Y'all gotta go watch it to see what I'm talking about. Right. <laughs> and so what about after the after party. He even surprised me with something else after the party. <laughs> like after everybody <laughs> left. I'm not gonna tell you exactly what it is because you just gotta go watch the video so it can all make sense to you. It'll mm -hmm. all come together. But do you like that though? Like, mm -hmm. I love that. Cause I, I'm serious. I was thinking of everything that I thought that one that you would love mm -hmm. and two that would make it like you know how you be like best birthday ever right. that's what i meant by like it was so awesome i can't even really describe it because it was like i was already like excited in the moment and like <coughs> excuse me super <clears throat> excited about the party then he hit me with a after party surprise mm -hmm. it was just like I don't know, you kind of just be like, dang, what else and why? You know what I'm saying? Like, I had a good time. There's nothing else that you can do to make me more happy right now. Mm -hmm. So that's how I felt. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. Yeah, and like I said, my goal... <clears throat> Thank you. My goal was to, like I said, make this the best birthday ever and make it very memorable. I'm a person who cares a lot about memories. Like, memories should last a like, lifetime. That's me. I'd rather spend money on memories than, like, material stuff. Mm hmm And I just think it's something that will last a lifetime because mm -hmm. we've had, like, parties that we went to with just my family. Mm -hmm. And now we've done something with just no, her family. family. Yep. And we both know our family's gonna just mm -hmm. click. Mm -hmm. um, my mom actually gave her a card that it was, it was pretty dope. It was awesome. And that card was it was like so real like mm -hmm. it got me a little emotional at the time Aww. when she read it because I was like, and i can't even say the whole card verbatim but she says it was like a line in there that my mom had said like you fit. wasn't born into this family yeah but you, you fit, fit in it so well or something you fit this in our family. hearts mm -hmm. and stuff and it was like wow like yes. it was my perfect. mama read the card again yeah. after i read it because she, she was like oh mm -hmm. okay it was so perfect you know um because that's truly how i feel about her that's mm -hmm. truly how i feel about this woman like you know people mm -hmm. always talk about they dream girl they dream guy i tell her all the time you my dream girl mm -hmm. you know and um <laughs> I'm gonna do whatever I can to make her the happiest woman in the world. Uh -huh. you know? and, I was so happy. And I do it because that's what she does for me too. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, I have a lot of first with this woman. Do you know I seen some at the dollar store and they have like, um, I don't know if I'm gonna remember, but I'm gonna say it was like this plaque and it said, our first. So everything you had to write in, like everything y'all did together for the first. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh, I should get that. Yeah, that was, mm -hmm. that was really sweet. Mm -hmm. I'm, gonna go, I'm gonna go back and get it. Yeah, like uh, I'ma ask my baby to do something, even though I know y'all seen it. 
But at the end of this video, I'm gonna ask her just to kind of close it by lifting the camera just so y'all can see what's above our head. <laughs> because she she did that and I, I love it. I did that. I <laughs> love it. I actually thought she was gonna have it on the screen, but it's all, it's it's cool, you know. She know what she's doing when she mm -hmm, do this. Mm -hmm. But uh, <laughs> you can, can you make that happen though at the end. So uh, it wasn't just the ordinary party. It was all of her family celebrating and showing love to her and they did that yeah it, <laughs> i mean you know that. what babe it was so much love mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying like everybody like you know how you have i'm talking to y'all you know how you have some get togethers gatherings parties dinners and so and so Something over there wrong. hating on you, or mm -hmm. so and so over there, they there, but they ain't really happy for yeah. you. It was none of that, mm -hmm. man. And I like that. Like, it show you how much they love this woman. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And you know, one thing about family is you don't have to talk every day. And sometimes you'll get together and pick right up where you left off. And, you do and that's what I too. felt. Everybody was showing me love. Everybody was talking about how much they've heard about me. That The ones that I didn't meet, because mm -hmm. a lot of them I have. Mm -hmm. And it was just like, they know like this is, this fits. You know what I'm saying? And I- Like a glove. Huh? Yeah, yeah, I love that. I love that. Her mom, her, her, uh, what's Muda is your nephew, mm -hmm. right? When we were singing, he was so happy. Muda was so happy. Mm -hmm. He was like doing the beat. He was like doing the beat. Yeah, for us. I got to, I got to meet my great niece on that day. Yeah. Yeah. It was awesome, y'all. Mm -hmm. When I tell y'all from beginning to end, it was awesome. So I'm gonna ask you though, mm -hmm. leading up to it. Mm -hmm. Could you have expected that or did you expect it was going to be that? No. I mean, no and yes. Mm -hmm. Because, I don't know, I was so happy that I didn't imagine me being that happy. Did you expect me having everything that I had though? Yeah, because I know you. <laughs> okay. Like, yeah. <laughs> I know, I, that's why I wasn't really bugging you really about nothing. I was just like, I'm gonna let him do his yeah. thing or whatever. Y'all, it was one blooper. <laughs> it was one blooper. What? And I was so mad. And she was, she knew I was mad, but she was trying to keep me calm. So I had to pick the balloons up at one mm. o'clock. Keep in mind, I done went everywhere for these balloons. And she kind of explained to me later on that these type of balloons that i got is really what you're supposed to order online just so you can know for sure you have them right so i went from this store to that store to target to walmart i mean i went to so many stores just to end up back to the first store so the first store had the number three in gold mm -hmm. but they didn't have the number two so I finally did find number twos, which I guess is very popular because everywhere was sold out of the number twos in the particular <laughs> color that I was looking for. <laughs> so I didn't know that some stores don't blow them up. She had to school me on that afterwards too. So the store I bought it at, they ain't blow it up. So I ended up having to go back to store one who would blow it up, but they want to charge you to blow it up. Mm -hmm. So, you still money. man, so I spent, mm -hmm. no, I'm good now. I spent a lot of money on the balloons. I just say it like that. I'm not putting a number on it. Mm -hmm. And when I tell y'all, I was so geek. I was coming to take them to put them in the car. I don't know what happened, but every one of those balloons flew away. All of the uh, threes I and cried. twos. I would have cried, y'all. And I'm talking about, this is days of, before I go to work trying to get this together finally get it together mm. I went back in that store like y'all never gonna believe what was <laughs> happening and she was the lady she was like I'm so sorry that happened the only thing I can do is sell it to you and not tax it <laughs> I'm like so I had to pay for them all over again and this time I had the mismatch too but she like I said trying to keep me cool and calm she like we gonna set a new trend and it actually looked good like that the, the I, I like it like that with the gold three and the rose gold mm -hmm. two it actually looked really good like I like that. it like that it made both of them stand out that's yeah. what I think yeah. so I was like I'm gonna be doing this from now yeah. on <laughs> But, you had to find out that way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but you know what? It was something I didn't care. I wanted to do for my baby. 
and mm. I loved it. Mm. It was awesome. It was everything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. So what about when you were, when do you think you got the most excited about it? Like, were you getting dressed? Have you talked to Will? Like, when, when do you think you got the most excited about the it? The most, I'm about to say, well, I'm about to say, well, the most? And her outfit, oh my God. Yeah, I was about to, I was about to say probably when I put my outfit on. Oh my God, y'all gotta when go check When I video was out. in the room and I put my outfit on and I put the camera in front of me, I was like, it's about to happen. Like, this is about to be awesome. I think I got real excited after I saw myself in the camera, after I put my outfit off. Mm -hmm. That's when I got like super excited. I felt like I was high already and I hadn't drunk nothing. <laughs> I was excited when she told me her brother was here mm -hmm. because I, she, I mean, she had this joy, like mm -hmm. joyful look on her face. Mm -hmm. And I got really excited when my cousins came through in the clutch mm -hmm. and had everything together by the time I asked them to have it together because I'm really anal y'all when I want something done at a certain time I want it done at a certain time mm -hmm. and they came through in the clutch because you know sometimes folks be like we dealing with family we can be a little late you know mm -hmm. and I don't care I was thinking about that too y'all I ain't gonna lie baby I'm, I was thinking like they probably gonna show up when they want to mm -hmm. you know not trying to talk about them but yeah. it's just about family you yeah. know how family do and i told but i i, I told my cousins i said look y'all treat this like y'all doing this for a fortune 500 company mm -hmm. y'all gonna be professional and have it there and that's what i expect mm -hmm. and they took care of me for y'all i had a yellow cake and strawberry cake mm -hmm. And they both was awesome. Slapping. 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 My brother even had a cake because his birthday is in like yeah. a few days from now. My mama got him a cake, so go check that out. Also, so y'all can see mm -hmm. what kind of cake he had too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, uh, it was another funny part that, uh, and this is one of her favorite nephews, uh, Jasir. Mm -hmm. Jasir wanted to stay. Mm hmm. It was so funny. He wanted you know, to kids, stay. No kids, they come to a party. They want to stay after. He wanted to around. stay. He was playing a game mm -hmm. with his cousin. Mm -hmm. well, he know what and he ain't know what to call his cousin. He was like, I want to stay. Was first I want to stay with. Him. <laughs> I want to stay with with, with him. Yeah. <laughs> so it was just a blast yeah. all the way around. So the last blooper was her hairstylist went in the wrong house. Oh my goodness. <laughs> But we have not confirmed listen, that I was yet, told. We was told that. Mm -hmm. yeah. I was told that he told my cousin that he went into the next door neighbor <laughs> house and he thought it was our house. Like he just walked back in. I think it's when he went outside and came back in. I'm not sure, but he like walked outside and came back in and went into the wrong house. So mm -hmm. I don't know. We didn't confirm it, but, but yeah. we was told that he walked if, into the if wrong. If that's house. true, it was hilarious. Mm -hmm. But like we said, we had a good time. We had a good weekend, and we was very tired because we did a lot of partying. But a lot, a lot of dancing, a lot mm -hmm. of partying. You ain't used to doing that no more. You kind of get wore out mm -hmm. faster than your old days and stuff right. like that. So here's I'm gonna join on myself now because she was laughing so hard at me about this. So earlier today, I'd say, okay, I'm gonna get up and watch the game. I watched the game and I think I said something to you about girl I'm over here watching this game. It was like Whoa. No, I stood I came and stood over him and was like, You and Carly knocked out. He was like, I'm watching the game. I'm like, the game watching you. You ain't watching nothing. But I know we was tired, so I was Man. like, he, he get a pass. I know we we tired. I cut that game on. I think I watched Maybe twenty minutes. Twenty total, minutes and I was out of there. Total all together. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Out of there. I woke up just in time to see them lose. <laughs> but yeah, it was a uh, like I said, it was a good weekend. I was happy. My baby was happy. Enjoyed her weekend. Like I said, I had a ball. The plus mo a blast. Sorry, sorry for cutting you off. Mm -hmm, but the the <laughs> most important part for me though is that I was able to do all this with her. You did. You did that. Because uh, it made it that much more special because we did everything together. Y'all better get y'all one if it's some left. <laughs> I'm trying to tell y'all. Did, did I tell you I love when you say that? I love when she say that, y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all. 
<laughs> Boy, y'all be on cloud nine every day. Mm -hmm. Feel like you off a perk every day, though. <laughs> you know what? When we was coming from her stylist party, we saw these uh, motorcycles. They was lit. It was yeah. sweet. Yeah, so they we even had a sweet. lit. Mm -hmm. Well, Thursday ain't even the weekend, but we just calling it the weekend. Mm -hmm. we, our weekend started Thursday, yeah. basically. Yeah. <laughs> but thank y'all for tuning in and listening to my lit birthday surprise party that my boo boo threw for me. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, it was lit, and we wanted to talk about it with y'all so I can explain to y'all my part. He can explain like his part on his end, how he felt and stuff. So make sure y'all smash the like button and I'm about to show y'all our picture mm -hmm. up there. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna close it. Or no, I'm not about to close it. No. Oh, I just well, I told them to smash the like button. I got me a free kiss. <laughs> so I'm gonna I'm gonna move this up so y'all can see our picture. Oh, oh look at look that, y'all. Yes. Isn't that nice? Isn't love grand? Aww. <laughs> That's a nice picture. But make sure y'all comment down below on this video and wish me a happy belated birthday. Also, yes. it's still my birthday. Mm -hmm. And don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell after you subscribe so you won't miss no videos that I be dropping. Mm -hmm. Okay? But for now, your girl is out. Peace.